gonna get a strip show? Did you just... <laughs> hey, what are you doing? My God! Who sent you? Doc! Wait. Did you have a stroke? <laughs> what the fuck? Because I think I had a stroke. Because Jack Frost bored the crap out of us, we figured we cannot do our Christmas special without watching a really bad film. So we just started perusing Amazon Prime. We're scraping the bottom, really. We were looking at Jack Frost 37. <laughs> we found out there are a million Silent Night, Deadly Night movies. I think they're still making them, from oh. the looks of it. What do we find? Ginger Dead Man with Gary Busey? <laughs> Killer bongs, whatever. <laughs> weird, weird stuff. Some Robocop versus Zombies movie. Robo Vampire 2, I think it was called. Yeah, that is yeah. coming up soon. But then you stumbled on a good one. Good looking one. Scorpion. I can never remember the name. It's Scorpion Thunderbolt. Scorpion Thunderbolt. <laughs> I can't remember it because there are no scorpions in it and there are no thunderbolts in it. No, no, there, no. They just said these are two cool names. Well, what was in it? <laughs> this, is, this is the most insane movie we've ever watched. I've never seen anything like this. The first half an hour in particular are just nonsense. Like just scenes that have nothing to do with each other thrown together. Yeah, back I, to back. They, they give you full bore. This, this movie starts out running and we don't know any of the characters. We don't know the rules of this movie, the mythology behind Why are these. they dying? Why is she naked? Where are they running to? Why is it so dark? What's the dragon snake monster? It's a kind of a snake. Snake! As best we can tell, the story of Cannibal Thunderbolt is... Scorpion Thunderbolt. Scorpion Thunderbolt is the Pied Piper... The is blind Pied Piper. ...working in conjunction with Freddy Krueger hands. <laughs> the, uh, witch. The vampire witch. <laughs> vampire. Which is not explained. We just see this crazy lady with these, you know, gold-painted bugle corn chips on her fingers banging on a drum and then the pipe piper comes through and then people start dying she has one breast out the whole time the whole time <laughs> some reason she works in conjunction with the pied piper to turn a reporter woman into a snake dick monster thing which kills people so that then freddy krueger hands can drink their blood i think which is like magically teleported to her lair studio apartment now that's the best we can tell what's happening here. Like we're not a hundred percent that that's what we might have gotten it wrong. How? It that's was so what, clearly. That's explained. what it looks like. But but what we found out was that this movie was not always this way. It was made once apparently, recut into Scorpion Thunderbolt, <laughs> and they added in uh, an American actor for reasons. And this guy was Captain. Texas. I mean, he's got the stash, he doesn't wear a shirt, he's got the dirty blonde hair, doesn't give a shit. He's always working out and just killing, he's oiled up, killing the local Asians. He's the best. <laughs> when he's in there, he's just killing Asians. That's all he does, and for no real reason. They like. They just attack him and he fucks him up. Yeah. <laughs> That's his role. That's what he does. And we think it was all about this ring. It was never explained. We never why. knew there was a ring until, like, <laughs> he kills, like, three attackers and he goes to some fortune teller to ask about this ring and why people are trying to kill him yes and the fortune teller tells him <laughs> it's the ring that can kill the vampire witch freddy krueger tit and you need to take it to her with this gold sword 
and a compass or whatever the hell it was that a little, was. little mirror. A mirror. Yeah. And he's like... So he's walking around now with all this shit. And like, <laughs> you'd think a normal person would take this ring and chuck it over the side of the mountain he was on. Yeah. Instead he's like, well, I gotta kill Tit Kruger or whatever the hell. I don't think that's her name, but... Yeah. Okay. What was her name? Einboob. Oh, okay. That's a, Never mind. That's a... What's it? Einhorn? Finkel is Einhorn. Einhorn is Finkel. Wow, that was that was a joke you had to work for. Yeah, that one went a little over my head. Sorry. Well, well done. Yeah, it's called humor. Look it up. <laughs> <laughs> we have detective pedo guy who's he's trying to date everyone. Report. Yeah, he, he's got a lot of girls. We start off with his first girlfriend gets attacked by some a guy. He who was that guy? He was some guy he pissed off like years ago and came back for, the guy came back for revenge. Then he kind of disappeared. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. It was like, yeah. it was getting real rapey. Yeah. He, he beat that guy off. Better. I don't know, that would have worked in this movie. That, it, it, we wouldn't have batted an eye. At that point, I, we were so confused we probably wouldn't even notice. Most of us watch, most of the time we're watching this movie, we're just like, what? Who is that? Yeah. What's happening? What? So is that Piper? Does he control the spirit of the snake demon? I need answers. They're still fighting like it's Peter and the chicken and family guy, though. <laughs> I love those fights so much. Last thing, this movie, like, yeah, it starts out this incoherently, then we get some weird rapey scenes and some character development, then there's just these two other random people. It's a love story about them, and one of them turns into a monster sometimes, so it's like a werewolfy movie, but like, like... Well, we got to watch them go hunting, fishing, camping, and then she turned into a snake but, dick monster. Always happens. And then... That's why you don't use Tinder. <laughs> <laughs> An American... Hooker. Oh, yeah. Prostitute. No, she wasn't a hooker. What was she? She, well, because she looked like a hooker. So the guy, one guy tried to pick her up. Yeah. And she was like, eat shit. And then an American guy came to pick her up. Well, we she, didn't know that because like, it was just his car zooming by and then she just flashes it. Flashes it. So was she a hooker? And then they I go. Said so she was an actress or something? Because yeah, they went to the theater to watch her performance. They're catching a movie. Well, it's a good movie, though. Oh. Something like that. And then she got a little, like, frisky, and then, like, a scene must have been missing or lost in a fire or something, because then the next scene, she's dying and a demon or something. And the guy's like, who do you work for? And then it's over. Did she just... <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Who sent you? Talk! Wait. Did you have a stroke? What the fuck? Because I think I had a stroke. We were missing a solid five minutes of something in there. And then she's never seen again, never mentioned again, gone. So, what kind of movie would you call this? Is it insane? A... <laughs> it's kind of a kung fu movie. We get some fight scenes. A little bit, mostly with an American guy, though. Yeah, the, but the longest fight was the um, the Serial cop in that previous guy thing. Yeah, the previous. It's like a guy. fantasy horror, soft core. Uh, <laughs> I don't even know. This movie's indescribable. No, no. It you have to see it to believe it. It's it's insane. And don't pay money for it. <laughs> We're gonna go, no, God, no. This is on Prime for a reason. <laughs> At one point, there is a man who seems to be eating a fox. <laughs> yeah, the man is eating a fox. <laughs> climbs a tree and is throwing chunks of it at people. And they get him to come down out of the tree by showing him a live cat that he can eat instead. Fresher. 
That's, that's a cat. cat. And then they capture him, and then that's the end of that storyline. Yeah, they thought he was one of the murderers or something. Again, like, this movie was either edited and sliced and diced until it was unrecognizable, or they didn't finish making it or something. I, it I it makes know. no sense. At the end, when Captain Texas is fighting the witch... Yeah, I don't even know his name. The Indiana Jones music from Raiders of the Lost Ark starts playing in the background. They ripped off the Indiana Jones movie. I was going to the same thing. That's Raiders of the Lost Ark. Holy shit. Wow. The Chinese don't give a fuck. My I God! I didn't like. I didn't like the movie, but the soundtrack was awesome. <laughs> they totally stole it. Not like they took some samples and redid it. Like they straight took it out of the movie mm -hmm. and put it under the action. <laughs> that, that was the ending credits. Was and that's it. Raiders of the Lost Ark. <laughs> and it was very recognizable because because a couple people have seen that movie. Wow. D no credits. <laughs> Done. Is. Freddy Krueger hands so bad it's good. Scorpion Thunderbolt. Is Scorpion Thunderbolt so bad it's good? No. No, I, it's it's Really? Yeah. I can't I can't recommend it. It's 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 not nothing is really over the top enough for me for it to be so bad it's good. It's 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 a little hard to understand. There's not a little? <laughs> it's not great in everything. It's, if you're I, it was, it's a romance movie, and like I'm not, I'm not keen on that. It wasn't fun. That whole hell storyline wasn't fun. It took it's up a, a major chunk of the movie. Taking milk baths. It's a and they and they were banging in the woods with the whole neighborhood watching them. It was weird. I, I guess it has its own has its charm, but I, I can't recommend it. You have to be, you have to be in the right frame of mind, and I think that is on like some sort of LSD to watch this movie. I'm gonna go the opposite way. I think this is so bad it's good, 100. percent I'm going to watch this with other people, primarily because I want to watch their faces <laughs> during the first half hour, 45 minutes, <laughs> as they're trying to figure out what's happening. I wonder what our faces looked like. I'm going to recommend this to everyone, primarily because it's free if you're an Amazon Prime member. Just go on there, search for Tit Kruger. S and Scorpion Thunderbolt. It'll come right up. I was burping <laughs> during that. That was yeah, great. That was nice. That was good. That was good. Thanks, man. And uh, enjoy yourself. Or turn it on, lock someone in a room, and leave. <laughs> Take the remote with you so they can't turn it off. <laughs> Torture them. And Watch their mind melt. Enjoy your divorce. <laughs> Give me your ring. Tell me what's so special about that ring. Nothing. Just hand it over. Come and get it. All right, well, happy, happy sweet baby Jesus day. Happy sweet baby Jesus day. doesn't taste like baby. I am getting a hint of Jesus. Okay. <laughs> All right.